Hello everyone. Today I am going to start marketing management and this is a module 1 introduction to marketing based on VTU syllabus for MBA students. The syllabus in the unit 1 it is importance of marketing, definition of market and marketing, types of needs, elements of marketing concept, functions of marketing, evolution of marketing, marketing versus selling, consumer value and satisfaction, four P's of marketing, marketing environment, techniques, characteristic, micro as well as macro level. Uh, market and marketing. See, what is market? Market is referred to the set of where the potential buyers and sellers can meet to exchange goods or their services. They meet their requirement. It is a basically a medium that uh, facilitates their, these transactions in an economy. It allows for the exchange of goods or services information under the protection of the law and generally in exchange for the consideration. Previously, the barter system was there where we are able to exchange the goods in terms of one person will give one thing, another person will give other things, so they can exchange the goods or services. Marketing. According to the Philip Scottler, defines marketing as the science and the art of exploring, creating and delivering value to satisfy the need of a target market at a profit. So, importance of marketing means first is your customer satisfaction. Competitive advantage, corporate image, expansion of business, economics of scale, efficiency, organizational objective, optimal use of resources, then brand loyalty, brand equity, brand image, benefit to stakeholders. Because where first we our basic need, who is your consumer or customer, and what is the customer's nature? So what is their need, want, and demand? What kind of product they want? What is their um, motive to buying that particular product what is the range they want to buy what is the competitive advantages so all that here we will discuss here the market and marketing market means it is a comparison market is a narrow concept and marketing is a much wider concept than market so market is a point where interaction of buyers and the sellers marketing is a social process it is a process by which human need to identify and evaluate and satisfy Market is a set or place where the point of interaction. Marketing is a process involving a few 12 activities. And market, type of activity, goods, traded, all the services, quantity, geographical location. Marketing means it is a generally uniform or any type of goods or services. So types of need. So first is stated so like customer want to buy a car. Like Then what is the reality? They are rational or genuine need or like he want the car operating cost. Or unsettled about the buying the car, consumer also accept the good services from the dealers. What's the delight? Means when the consumer does not split express the good something like what they have to do, then what is the consumer main state with status symbolities or what why he won't he can show his friend that he is having a savvy customer. All that this is the types. Element of marketing concept. See, element means just I already told you what is the consumer need, want and demand. Then who is your target positioning and segmentation, offering and brand, value and satisfaction, marketing channel, supply chain management, competition, marketing planning. So element of marketing says first I know if the customers need, want and demand I know. Then like based on that I will prepare a product. Then what is the target positioning and segmentation I have to divide. Then offering and brand. Then the value satisfaction, marketing channel. Supply chain management from the manufacturer to end user, how it will reach within the time duration. So time management is important. Distribution channel, competitive environment is there now. So before that you have to do the marketing planning. So these are the elements. Function of marketing. See here, already we discussed. First you have to identify the need of the consumer. Based on their the consumer need and their budget, I have to plan. Then what are the... The same product, identical product will come in that range that we have besides product development, standardization, grading, packaging, leveling, branding, customer service, pricing, promotion, distribution channel, transportation and warehousing. So evolution of marketing concept here is the production concept means what's the value product availability. Then product concept, key product value, what is the quality, selling concept, value, sell stimulation the marketing concept means value customer satisfaction we have to see marketing concept we have to satisfy customers need we have to create a value 
societal concept based on the value sustainability and hostile marketing means value relationship and responsible so evolution of marketing we will do in detail in next slide and then marketing environment according to the uh, dr philip kotler uh, company's marketing environment company's marketing environment consists of the actors and forces outside the marketing and the effect marketing management ability to develop and maintain successful transaction with its target consumer so that is very important ki marketing environment you have to create a environment where you are able to develop and maintain the successful transaction so in the marketing environment we have internal and external internal means we have hr department operation department account finance r and d top management and in external we have a micro factor and macro factor under the micro factor we have a market demand consumer which industry who are your competitors what is your need all that we have to decide it there and the second will be here you have to know that key what is the uh, your industry policy who all are competitors suppliers government policy time to time it will change so you have to specify that also ki what is your marketing policy and how they are doing that so all that thing are very important to maintain the product so that is important and then macro means it is based on the technology it is like overall world so what is the socio cultural relationship economic factor political factor industrial factor interest rate factor demographic factor legal government policies time to time it will change so that we have to consider while opting that so that is important technique used in environment analysis so we have a sort analysis what is the strength weakness opportunity and threat then what is the pestle analysis scenario planning michael porter five forces basic comparison between micro and macro is micro means it is nearby environment and the firm operates inside the company what they are doing that is your micro factor macro means industry as a whole key in the whole that same kind of industry what kind of thing is going on so that we have to see then macro refer the general environment can affect the working for all business enterprises i told the same kind of business and it will affect to overall business, every one's business so all business element it is cosmic cosmic means what what is your competitor organization itself suppliers market intermediaries and customers pestle analysis i told that time it is what is that it is based on your uh, a political economic social cultural technological and legal and environment so pestle analysis is important in the nature of elements is specific here it is external and all these factors controllable so yes but it is to some extent only and influence directly regularly so these is the other things overall about your uh, marketing unit 1 so next class i'll give the detail ppt based on this so thank you